Yeah, therapist so talked that cheating right out of me. Yeah. That's they talked the cheating even, right out oh, of me. Oh, yeah, yeah. Made me realize it was me all along. I was like, oh, fuck. Well, what, 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 how was it? Well, I just I wasn't happy what was with it. You wasn't happy with, with yourself, so you were looking for something to kind of... But we get that we get that from the hood, though. That's so you think therapy you really, the really hood. works then? So you're, you're someone that recommends therapy to people... I don't know, I ain't recommending shit to nobody. Oh, all right. You do whatever y'all want to do. I'll do. I do. But does I it work for I you? I, I, I definitely recommend therapy. It's stop in my life. It's never stopped since 11. It's been okay. a continued thing for mm. me. So, yeah. yeah. I think now, some people would say that's probably bad for my therapist because they think I'm nuts. But, yeah, no. Therapy for me is not a 911 thing. It's not a, oh, shit, something going on. It's a, you just go. Yeah, when everything's cool. Facts. When everything's cool, you, you Facts. yeah. Because at some points things were not cool. What's well, like things man. will never always be cool. So I mean, life is gonna happen. The universe is gonna happen. Therapy is just helping you, you get in it. touch with how think, we gonna deal with things as they come I and think, being able to hear and see shit differently. Now it jades me because I've been in therapy so much that when people talk, all I hear is the therapist version of what they say. Right. Mm. Like he was talking, all I heard was all selfish, 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 selfish. Like, right. <laughs> 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 even with you, you, when you used to start talking about the uh, poly, uh, poly, whatever the word is, shit. Mm -hmm. Like my brain, all the man went to, yeah, but would you be able to deal with her? So you're asking for something that, like, that's that's all shit that a therapist is giving me at some point. Absolutely. Right. Like, just my brain just you. goes there. Mm -hmm. That makes sense. Like, that's the curse of it. You should get a Muslim therapist. I'm not opposed to you. Should get a, people should get a therapist that they are compatible with. Right. Absolutely. Because that's the other part. You get people that say, no, nah, I tried therapy. It wasn't for me. Well, how many therapists did you go to? I like my therapist. The same Some therapists make shit worse. Some When I used to go. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember yeah. going yeah. to a relationship therapist, marital therapist, and that nigga ruined my shit even more. Look, really? I, I, I'll be honest yeah. with you. I've been in that before. They have their own shit going on, and sometimes he would just things that you say in, in that therapy session could trigger them. Oh, it, my baby! And I've been through it so me. much, like I see the triggers. I've I've had like people. And I'm like, oh, oh, you got an issue with that? That's ill. Oh, you nah, never hear the from horror a, stories from in a therapy. Woman, from a it's woman, therapy. Therapy. No, it was a bad one because my baby mom thought that she was gonna be Bullet right, and dudes. she got pissed and walked out of the therapy session. Got right up and was like, oh, you agreeing with this nigga? Oh, that's not and the And I was in there story. like, I told yeah, you, right. you was the one that was bucking. And she got right up. She yeah, said, so, some people we don't We never last. going back to him again. Fuck him, is what she said. Some we people don't last with it. Yeah. Well, she but, wasn't ready for that. She not, wasn't, but she but she suggested it. Yeah, yeah that's the other thing I, I learned. Like, sitting in couples therapy and just therapy with other people. If niggas ain't ready for therapy, they ain't ready for they therapy. Ain't ready like, for therapy. Like, I ain't mm. suggesting it and recommending it to people that... Therapy is something you got to get up and go. You got to be dedicated to it. Mm -hmm. Like the, the workout niggas get up and go to the gym. Mm -hmm. Like you got to go to therapy or have the therapist come to you, Zoom, have you do it. But mm -hmm. everybody ain't with that. People will suggest something because it's been like, again, water right. cooler shit. Hey, baby, I'm going to go talk to the lady. Right. Like they make it a thing. <laughs> 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 they make it a thing now. Right. Right. Don't worry, I'm going to never do that again. I'm going to talk to the call the lady. Like so yeah. it's like a running joke now. But niggas be needing therapy. That's the funny shit about all the shit. Like, you started talking about the Rory Mall shit, then you went into the slaughterhouse shit. Like, my therapist ears hear a bunch of men that claim to be cool and communicative that couldn't be expressive. <laughs> yeah. Mm. And I, I, that's, that's a big issue. That's right the now. root of it. That is a huge yeah, issue. Yeah, man. Now. So I want more men to just, and you're talking about rappers. Right. <laughs> But 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 as men, that, that, that's supposed to whole job it is. But but as men, like what, what <laughs> great rappers? What is that? That's what is my it? point. Like so, miss me with the great rapper shit today. Like I don't care about how nice of a rapper a nigga is. What type of men are we today? Can like we communicate that. through an issue? If something comes up, do you automatically think the worst? Yes. Uh, that's do you do you or do you give compassion? Do, do are you loving? Like what type of man? Are, are you spiteful? Are you vengeful? How do you deal with hurt? Like, there's so many things that gotta come into play now. Now. Mm -hmm. See, we was talking about money coming in. Fuck the money. Yeah. Mm. Feelings. Feelings. It started, yeah, exactly. it started feelings and emotions. Yeah. I, I think the most dangerous thing on the planet money just is, gonna come is a rich a, nigga um, with mental issues. Hmm. Most of rich yeah. niggas do have mental issues. Have mental issues. But it, it comes with I'm it. I'm watching Super Pump now on Showtime. I can't wait to get back home and get back to it. It's the Uber story. It's the mm. fight over Uber between, mm. I don't even know. But 
That nigga's a lunatic. <laughs> he is a lunatic. And I'm on, only on episode five. Damn. He is an arrogant ego. He's saying shit to people he shouldn't. <laughs> He's wilding in there. Yeah. But then you look around, <laughs> it worked. <laughs> He's it like worked. the Facebook dude. Uber the Facebook is. Dude was wild. The but, Facebook but, dude, same thing. Well, Steve Jobs, same thing. I watched something wild. about uh, but this is what I'm talking Carl about. Icon earlier, the fucking Wall Street legend. Same thing. Like these people, I've heard these stories about Hove. Like I've heard, like, stop it. There, <laughs> stop it. Is, mm. is there a mindset now that you, yeah, you know this? I don't care stuff. that you niggas can rhyme some words. Is there, is there a <laughs> mindset to people? who are wow. very ambitious that might be considered crazy? I think so. Sure. You have to be You have, have to have crazy. a you have you to have, have to a level crazy. of crazy. You can't I, be normal. No, no you can't be because you gotta you're thinking outside the box. You're going for things that you've never seen before, you've never seen other people, people do. do it. Right. So you have to have a level of crazy to even think that you're gonna accomplish these outlandish you're, things that people know. These things that other people think are outlandish, yeah. but and they're that's, not. That's the key to it. One of my uh, one of my favorite scenes in this movie. I can't remember the movie. There's two dudes talking about this third guy, and he says to him, um, he said, "Well, what's his plan?" He said, "Well, he's he's going to destroy the world." Mm -hmm. And the guy goes, "That's insane." And the dude looked at him and said, "The sanity of the plan is of no consequence." He said, "Why not?" He said, "Because he can do it. Uh -huh. He can do it." It is. It doesn't matter how crazy it is if it's I can pull it off. If I can there. fucking do it, what difference does it make? That shit gave me goosebumps. I mean, I think about my day-to-day -day life and the people who tell me, yo, you'll, that's crazy. The idea that you think you'll make a living that way, the idea that you think you can do X, Y, Z, A, B. When Slaughterhouse came up, when the first time Slaughterhouse came up, somebody told me I was crazy for the idea that let me get these guys together and put, them, and put them all on one record and they'll just ruin this track to the point where no one will ever want to do it again. Yo, you sound crazy. That'll never fucking work. That's what I got until it happened. And all of a sudden, it wasn't so crazy anymore. I think all of the things that changed the world at point of conception would look that like crazy. Ridiculousness. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Right. Bro, if I had to explain to you So why Uber, do we spend our time trying to be normalized? Because because that's safe. Fear. Oh my that's God. That's safe. The yeah. Bowen doc I watched, that a really... <laughs> when they was coming up with air transportation, oh yeah, niggas thought niggas was crazy. Yeah. And they was trying to figure it out. Planes were dropping, niggas was dying. Mm, but what? the concept... Yeah. Of, yeah. Mm. But the concept of, hey, we want to commercialize in the air. Like, we want to make the planet smaller so you can get to London in this amount of hours. It's like, why the fuck are you going to do that? Right. That sounds insane. The plane and the weight, you can only put two people on a plane. Then when the guy came and said, all right, I got a plane Dude. for 70, pe se oh, 70 yeah. people. Week ago, everybody looked at this nigga like, you crazy. That's where, uh, that's where uh, flight attendants came from. Flight attendants came from. It was too scary of an idea to get the public to accept. So they were putting nurses on the plane. To keep people calm. To make mm. people calm, but they didn't want to call them nurses. So they dressed them up like mm. a nurse, right. but they called them a, a flight attendant. Wow. That's the, where that comes from. The, the, the illusion the of fear. safety. The so illusion of safety. all of that shit is crazy. I mean, I, I, I crazy. think that, I, I mean, my personal philosophy, we're here to see what's possible. Wait, and then when you learn that it's not crazy, you run into the people that try to stop it. See, the first point of entrance is you crazy. Mm. The second point is, oh, you're not. You're genius. Now we try, we, we need to step we up. We need to stop you. Yeah. Because you're always cutting somebody's mm. throat. So, so like why, Tesla. why do we waste so much time trying to be normalized? Safe. Because it's, it's the safe way to be. It's safe. You never take the risk. You don't have to worry about the consequences that come with it. It's super. Most of most of the people I know in high school, it's safe. The nine to five job. I'm not Yo, mad bro, at anybody who see. call me crazy. Call me crazy. I'm here to see exactly what's possible. I don't care what everybody else did. I'm here to see what Math Hopper is possible of doing. Hey, period. And hey, let me let's have some fun with this because this is a good conversation. Mm -hmm. Let's get to the root of crazy. Where did that stem from? Who's the first 
We have no heard, idea. What the first time you heard that? Who was the first person that probably said crazy? Probably my mother. Crazy. Probably my mother crazy. probably said, yo, you crazy. You called me crazy yeah. last week. But that I'm is, not talking about when we shooting the shit, but the idea of someone being crazy. crazy. Mm. Their mind not functioning. Just being outside properly. of the norm, period. It had to be somebody who was in the tribe that was doing some different shit, and everybody was like, what is he doing? Guess who's we guess, don't do that. Guess who established we don't walk the norm, We that close though. to the forest. A, cra a crazy <laughs> person. Hold on, but a crazy person established the norm. If you think about it, when you're shifting culture like that and you get everything standardized, now it becomes the norm. Right. Because someone has to think outside the box to get a group of people to settle down and really adhere to whatever the policies are. Right. And now that's, it becomes safe. That's based around fear. That's no, based no, around course, fear of what happens crazy when you step outside of it. A crazy person changes the standard. There you right. go. It's a, it's a, it's a whole a leader. regular nigga somewhere. I, I, yeah. say, I say, up, I say a leader. Made up the, a, a leader. It's, it's a one percent. It's a one percent thing. They can be a leader, but they can believe, be a leader and who knows what. So the first crazy person that we would have on record would be Cain. Cain was crazy for killing his brother Abel. Crazy is insane. No, bigger. That's not insane. where we going. That's not where we crazy going right now. That's not where we going, bro. That's not where we going, bigger. Bigger. That's not where we going. We talking about people who, who change the standard of 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 normalcy, change in society, did not right? Change. Wait, did not. Did Cain killing his brother not change? But we not not in a not in a negative way. I'm talking about in in a making things better when people thought that that was not the thing to do and they did it and now everybody's like, yeah, we should be like him. No, mm. you talking about like no when Noah did the ark. No, because everybody didn't make boats after. You talking about the Everybody's Mac computer? Steve Jobs was crazy and the Mac computer is making everything. Like the iPhone. Steve, like Steve Jobs. Like, 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 like everybody's Steve like, Jobs. no yeah. one's gonna have a phone without buttons. Blackberries are gonna be here forever. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. And no. what was the difference about Noah? If I told you that, Noah I know. Noah built the ark. Bigger, we're not talking about the Bible right now, bro. We're not talking about the Bible right now. Okay, if I told you that I could I could invent a company, a transportation company that didn't own any cars, you looked at me like I was nuts. But mm -hmm. here's Uber. If I told you that I could invent a company that would house people all around the world for a fee, but I don't own any property, Airbnb. you'd Airbnb. tell me I was nuts. But here's Airbnb. Right. It, it always looks nuts until you, you pull it off. I could be a podcaster and send a, sell a million records at the same time. Call me nuts. No, I but my name is Math Hopper, motherfucker. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> why not? That's not crazy, though. That's, yeah, that's why I don't, that's own, very I don't even call nobody nuts today. That's like something that they do to, like, they weaponize the term. Mm. Yeah, to, to, to kind of make, dismiss you. Dismiss your, your, your well, to sterilize you. With the history of America, that, that's, they, they came up with that. Like controlling mass media and putting Definitely. certain shit out there so we demonize and view you a certain way. I mean, and now we do. We just adopt shit that we don't know where it came from. Right. But yeah, I try not to do that. They called Antonio Brown crazy when he fucking took his shirt off, ran off the field. He looked nuts. If you're looking at the screen, this looks nuts because we never seen no shit like this. I don't know if he's crazy. I wasn't there. I don't know what Bruce Arians said to him. Mm -hmm. I know he don't fuck with him. He might say, suck my dick and never play again. He injured. I don't know. I might have did that. And know what they would have said? That nigga's crazy. crazy. They call me crazy my whole fucking career. But I would had plenty reason to be crazy. So I mean, I try not to use that. And with mental health being a thing today, it's like crazy. Like we want to be very careful with what we say and how right. we say it. It's hot for trap trapper turn smack rapper. Smack. Only smack rapper that you know is smack rappers. Got bars I can hang with the backpackers. Uh -huh. Trap star, I don't hang with the backpackers. I'm in the hood with the work you heard. Making fiends leave earth you heard. Got your baby mama thirst you heard. Feel the